Hello guys, what's up? Welcome back to my kitchen. So today we're going to be making cookies, so we'll roll the intro and we'll be back in a second. <laughs> Right, so guys, the first thing you want to do is get all your ingredients put in a bowl. So, first of all, get all the dry ingredients in. So, you need 200 grams of some raisin flour. Next, 100 grams of plain flour. Next, you need a caster sugar. The reason why I'm serving it is, if you don't know if you can see this, but it's quite lumpy, so let me sift that. Next, again, to sieve in the coke powder. The reason is it's going to sometimes be lumpy. Then add half a teaspoon of salt. After that, you're going to get your butter. We're going to melt that in the microwave, so I'll be back in one second. Right, so next, what you want to do is get your melted butter. Then put it in. Right, that's 100 grams of melted butter. And then, get your eggs. And a separate cut like that. Then just add them in. The next thing you want to do is just cream them all together using an electric mixer. Next, make sure all the mixers are really properly. Next, get this and then just squeeze it all together form a dough-like consistency. Because what I'm doing is I'm just doing that and just battering it up against the side like that. It's a bit too dry, you can always add in just a tad bit more. Kind of like a dough, like that. Next, you want to get your chocolate chips. Then I'm just going to knead them in. Put them in like that. Just knead them in like that. I'll be back when all these chocolate chips are Right, so once you all your chocolate chips are in the dough, I'm going to get baking tea. Ice cream scoop, then just scoop them in. One full ice cream scoop is one, just then just stitch them like that on the beaten tray. So guys, that's the amount of them now, so they're looking pretty pretty. The finished product should look a bit like this. So, thanks for watching this video. Please like and of course subscribe for more videos, probably like this one. And also, as always, the recipe is linked down below if you want to make these. By the way, I taste a wee bit of the test back and they're bloody lovely. Bloody lovely. Subscribe to my second channel where the video, which is currently going on behind me, has been uploaded to. So, thanks for watching and I'll see you later. Bye!